Hey everyone, it's Sierra. I'm one of the models and a stylist here at Philly Flair. I am doing my first ever YouTube video on a holiday glam look. I'm so excited to show you guys my products and um, one of my favorite looks. First, I started applying my MAC Studio Fix liquid all over my face. So next, I will apply the Studio Fix MAC powder just to give it a little more finished look. I'm using this Face Secrets little um, oval blending brush. I got it at TJ Maxx. Swivel it around a little and just lightly apply right over that makeup. So next I'm going to apply my Smashbox liquid um, primer on my eyes. It has more of a hold. And you don't need much. So we will move on to something else while that sets. So next I'm going to use my Tarte Contour Concealer and also I use this with my MAC Liquid 100 brush. So I'm just going to apply this under the eye, down the middle of the nose, middle of the chin, and I actually apply this um, on my lips because it holds the liquid. Um, if you wear lipstick, it holds it better. And also I'm going to apply this on the eye. Then I'm taking my MAC 100 brush, liquid brush, and I'm just going to start patting it. Next, I'm going to put on my Bare Minerals Illuminator. This just really gives a nice highlight right on the cheekbones, right where that line was. So next, I'm gonna grab my Bare Minerals bronzer, and I'm just gonna apply it with um, a brush I got from Walmart. You can get these in little kits. Um, just so it's nice and thick. I'm just going to start in circular motions and bring your lips in. Then I'm just going to do this on the top of my forehead line. And also you're going to apply this on the outside rim of your nose just to kind of give your nose more of a distinct look. This is one heck of a blot. Um, this is just a finishing look, um, a finishing powder. This will just kind of help blend everything together. And I just have it with my Eco Tools brush. This also is Walmart or Target. And this you always want to apply and um, apply down. So the next step I go to. Um, I have my Anastasia dip brow and I do use a medium brow. My eyebrows are naturally really dark. They have like every shade possible. And I just have it with one of these angled brushes. So I will just open this up and you will see it's kind of like a, like a taffy mix. And you'll just apply it a little bit. I always start at the middle and go back. You just fill in real lightly at the Next, I'm going to grab um, another angled brush. And also, I'm going to grab, this is the Tarte concealer that I used earlier, and I'm just going to um, reapply to fix any like messy lines that I had on my eyebrows. So this comes out a lot, so I just like to pop it open a little and dab. like that nice and subtle but they're a lot more even now so next I'm gonna grab my Anastasia eyebrow gel this will just help keep all the hairs in place on your eyebrows and that will just dry it's clear so first I'm going to start off with my cat eyes and I will be using um, her right here, the top one. And I will start it off with one of my Bare Minerals flat brushes. This is gonna give you your shine look. I'm going to take my Bare Minerals palette and use the color Wheat right here. 
and I'm gonna use this with my thickest brush. I'm just gonna apply it right underneath that pearl color. Tarte palette and I will be applying Activist which is a deep brown color and I'm gonna apply this with just a tiny little pointed brush and then right below where you applied your last color we're gonna create a dark line You want to grab a color lighter so I'm going to be picking Jet Setter and as you can tell I use this palette quite a bit. I'm just going to kind of go back and forth over that line. So look, it should look something like this, pretty defined. And I'm going to take some more of that and really just um, go back and forth, I'll blend, blend, blend. I'm going to grab my Too Faced Cat Eyes. And I will be using Kitty Glitter Blue. And I will be applying it with just one of these thick end brushes that comes in eyeshadow palette. We'll be applying it all over the eyelid underneath our line that we made. Just dabbing lightly. You know, this can work on any eye color and with dark eyes, or dark hair, or dark eyes, this will probably pop even more. Now I'm gonna go back one last time and use my blending brush and go back to my Bare Minerals Wheat. Next, I wanna grab my Urban Decay Waterproof and it's the blackest black. I'm gonna apply this to my waterline. I'm gonna take um, this Jet Setter color and I'm just gonna apply that again. I'm just gonna kind of rub it into my waterline eyeliner. Just to give you that little smoky eye effect. I use just this um, Scandalous Eyes from Walmart. This one works good if you guys have sensitive eyes. I usually work back to front and then to get the wing you kind of want to angle the back of your eye to that line that I made when I was doing my contouring Sex um, Mascara. This is the only mascara I will use. This goes on the thickest and makes your eyelashes stand out like the most. I will literally wear wispies all day long. I like a drastic eyelash. My favorite glue is called Duo. D-U-O and I can get it from Ulta, Sephora. It comes in like a white color a clear color and a black. You can also blow and kind of turn these a little bit so when they're on your eye, they're not so stiff. Nice little pinches. And let it sit. This is my matte color, So Me. I've had a lot of like questions and people um, ask me what color this is. This is the So Me matte liquid matte. So I hope you guys like this little smoke show holiday clam. If you have any questions, um, go ahead and comment below and subscribe to our channel. And I hope to see you guys soon.